Hey everyone, this is Jenny Streeby with Confessions of a Hairstylist, and I'm so excited because I have Lola here with me. She is with WhatLolaLikes.com. You girls have to check out her website. The link is gonna be below. She is a lifestyle blogger, and we decided it'd be really fun to do a pairing. So she wore this really cute, flirty, modern outfit that's a little bit 1920s inspired, and what I went ahead and did for you girls today is a really fun twisted updo. It's really simple, and make sure you stay tuned to the very, very end because I'm gonna show you guys how to get a really fun editorial look out of this style. So let's go ahead and get started. To start off, I wanted to add a lot of texture to her hair. So what I did is I added a little bit of salt spray. I used Kirastas spray, a porter spray. This is just gonna add a lot of grip and grit to her hair. So now all I'm gonna do is I went ahead and created a nice central uh, profile parting. So now I'm just gonna take a section to the right, and this is gonna be like really um, freestyling it, and really um, it's gonna be all about just getting creative with it. So I'm basically taking a small section of hair, and all I'm gonna do is twist it going back. So I'm gonna twist it, I'm gonna add a little bit of Kirastas VIP Volume and Powder Spray for a little bit of texture. This is like back combing in a bottle. And I'm just twisting it to the side and then securing it with a bobby pin. So now working a section from our other side, I'm gonna do the same thing. So take that section of hair Twist it inwards, just crisscross it, and secure it with a bobby pin. Now the style is all about texture, so for this next section, what I'm gonna actually do is I'm gonna create a rope braid. So all I'm gonna do is take our section of hair, divide it in half, twist the right section to the right, and go over to the left. Now that our section to our left is over to our right, we do the same thing. Just twist that to the right and go up to the left. So now I'm just gonna go ahead and secure the ends with an elastic. And before I twist this up and over, what I'm actually gonna do for this one is just take our little bit of uh, VIP powder spray by Kirastas, spray it on there, and I'm simply just gonna pull it out just a little bit to add some texture to it. This really helps plump up our rope braid. It doesn't have to be perfect because we're going for that kind of tossly feel. So now that the rope braid's complete, I'm just gonna drape that over to our left side and bobby pin it into place. Now we're gonna repeat the same technique on the opposite side. And I'm just gonna drape this across to our other side. Now I'm gonna take another section from our right side and simply twist it inwards and drape it on the other side. So basically we're just uh, crisscrossing our sections, creating almost like a zigzag um, textured braid. Now that we've gotten to the ears, I'm gonna take larger sections. We kinda of wanna have like a little bit of erratic texture. So I'm gonna take a larger section and actually incorporate our rope braid that was um, in there previously. And I'm actually gonna twist it the opposite way just for a little bit of a different texture to it and still crisscross it to the other side and secure it with a bobby pin. I'm gonna repeat that same technique on the other side. Now that I've gotten to the nape of her neck, I'm gonna add a little bit more of the VIP powder spray by Kirastas. Get really aggressive with it. That's just gonna help, help add a lot of texture, a lot of oomph to it. It's gonna really help bulk up the hair. So now I'm just gonna simply continue to do the same thing. I'm gonna take our right section over to our left, 
and then pin that. So now that we have the ends left, I'm just gonna finish this look off by a simple rope braid. So twist it to the right, go over to the left, twist to the right, go up and over to the left. So now I'm gonna do, um, just kind of texturize our braid out a little bit. So I'm simply just gonna take it and just pull it out a little bit, give it more of a disheveled kind of feel. Okay, so now I'm just gonna take the ends of our rope braid and just twist that into the hairstyle and creating a really nice, fun, romantic updo. All right, so now just to finish this look off, all I'm just gonna do is a little bit of hairspray and there you guys have it. And you girls know by now this is my favorite, favorite part is to make it a little bit more edgy. So what I'm gonna do is just start pulling it apart, adding a little bit more of my powder spray just to add that texture to it to really give it a really whimsical look. So I'm just taking the twist. I'm gonna put a little bit of our powder spray on there by Kirastas and then just almost massage the texture out a little bit. And you can see how there's little pieces kind of flying out. This is definitely very runway. It definitely makes it a little bit fuller, more of a statement hairstyle. All right, so there you guys have it. A really fun, twisted romantic updo. Thank you, Lola, so much for being here. You guys have to check out our blog. Again, the link is gonna be below. And for hair tutorials every single week, please subscribe to my channel and I'll see you girls soon.